Hi YouTube, long time no see. Um, I have some very exciting news for everybody. Um, I have been accepted into the North Carolina Mustang Tip Challenge. Um, and we will be going and picking up a Mustang tonight. Well, actually we'll be picking it up in the morning, but since it's a six and a little over six hours of a drive, I'm gonna drive up tonight, stay at a friend's place, and then drive another hour and a half in the morning, pick it up, and then drive all the way home. I didn't wanna drive 12 hours, just cause you can drive 12 hours and it doesn't mean you should. So I'm not. Um, so I'm going tonight. What else? They're randomly assigned. I don't know what I'm getting. The competition is in 100 days. The tip competition is all groundwork based. There's no riding in the competition. Um, all the horses were $125 a piece, which I've already paid for mine. I think everybody was supposed to pay ahead of time, so I paid today. First time I've ever bought a horse sight unseen. And still, and like, I've never bought a horse sight unseen anyways, but I've never bought a horse sight unseen and never even seen a picture of it, so that's kind of crazy. But, and I've never drove this far for a horse. I've never had a horse shipped to me. Um, so this is really, really out of my element going and driving 12 hours for just one horse. But we're doing it, and it's going to be okay. And I really hope I get one that seems to be easy to train. I want a well-minded one. I'm insanely over the moon, insanely excited about picking up the Mustang and about getting my first ever Mustang. It's been a dream of mine for a very, very long time. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I know I love, I've been obsessed with like the Mustang, like pickup videos and the couple's first session videos. I love the transformation. So I'm, I'm planning to keep a running video, running video, or like a series of the transformation of my Mustang, whatever its name will be and whatever the horse turns out to be. So yeah, wish me luck, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> so I just thought I would include this. This is where we stayed at a friend's house that we are so, so thankful. And they have such a nice facility. They had a really pretty barn and arena. And then they had a round pit behind the barn and it was just gorgeous. And so I just thought we would share this with y'all. It was okay, beautiful. Okay, folks, um, we're in Tennessee. We are like two miles away from the place, but I didn't realize there was a time change. So now we have to sit here for like 30 minutes waiting to go pick up the Mustang. And my friend's in the bathroom right now. We stayed at a friend's house last night and then we left this morning at like seven. And now we're just waiting to get my Mustang. I did get one randomly assigned and they told me which one yesterday. It's not ideally what I was wanting, but it's what I got. And so we're just going to be happy with it. He is a five-year-old uh, Maverick Medicine gilding. And he it says he's a chestnut, but he does not look like a chestnut in the picture. So yeah, he looks black or like Maybe he's a liver chestnut. I don't know. But we'll see him probably in about 30 minutes. So, yeah. So, this is really just an overview of the facility in Pikeville, Tennessee. I was just trying to show everybody what it looked like. And, yeah. the This clip right here, now that it's showing, is just some yearlings running back and forth that somebody else was adopting. But what I was saying in the last clip in the truck... I was so scared when I found out that I got a five-year-old gilding. I was like, oh no, I drove all this way. I've spent all this money in fuel and I'm going to get something that's insane. Because of course, the first thing I look up about Maverick Medicine, I see that they're like crazy and stuff. And I'm like, oh great. And so now this clip that's about to show is the second time that I get to touch him. He just like fights with his friend, fights with the buddies in there and pushes them around. And then he comes and walks straight up to me. I don't know. Hi, buddy. Hi. Hi. Hi, bud. Hi. Oh, he just fell in the water. <laughs> Here 
the crew. Don't go by you, bro. Oh, that one got left. <laughs> okay. Don't be in such a hurry. <laughs> I'm not. He's really excited. <laughs> How far y'all got to go with it? Uh, six hours. Where did you come from? Mount Airy, North Carolina. I need to get over to that sale. Yeah, they're selling good lately. Like, Have they been? I don't know. I don't need nothing else. <laughs> I was like picking up one. <laughs> I had a jacket about like that one. Laid it on the, uh, on the uh, old propane heaters. Yeah. Laid it on there this morning. I'm like, oh, man, it's hot. Damn, the whole chest was burnt. I'm like, really? $100 jacket going. I love it. I just wish it was warm. Yeah. I'm going to touch it with everything. Oh, it's this cute one. behind this pole. Hey, reach in there and pull that gate to you. Don't even get his ass oh, out. I thought you were talking to me. I was like, okay. Oh. <laughs> Compared to my little mule, he's big. <laughs> Hell, I'm used to riding something that's 13 3. There you go. <laughs> oh, look. Hey. I'm not watch up. That was quick. Come on out there.
Sorry. Eight. 